Globalization and other competitive pressures are accelerating the need for manufacturers and industrial operators to improve what and how information is shared across their enterprises. Better information sharing drives better decision making, exposes process inefficiencies, facilitates best practice collaboration, and uncovers new competitive opportunities. Operationalizing the connected enterprise requires a carefully planned journey, which we've broken down into five key stages. We call it the Connected Enterprise Execution Model. It starts with a baseline assessment. This is a detailed study of the relationship between four key areas within your organization, including data and reporting, the production environment, network infrastructure, and security. The assessment helps to identify what devices to integrate and why, who will benefit from the data they provide, and whether your network can carry this data securely and efficiently to the right people. Stage two is secure and upgrade. A connected enterprise isn't truly connected without a common network infrastructure that facilitates communications between your automation and control systems and your enterprise network. Ethernet IP helps enable this network technology convergence through the use of standard Ethernet and Internet protocol, IP technology. For all of the benefits of connecting your site and production assets, it also introduces greater risk in the form of internal and external threats, both malicious and accidental. So a multi-layered security approach is a must, using both physical and electronic defenses. Working data capital is the focus of stage three. A connected enterprise resolves the many problems that you might be experiencing with your operational data, like separating the good data from the bad data, or how to convert data into meaningful, actionable information. Stage four is analytics. Data-based analytics can be viewed in real time via KPI dashboards and can be monitored in concert with other real-time data as well as against historical performance data. The data also can be presented and securely disseminated across your organization using web-based reports which can deliver relevant information to the right person or people via a mobile device, PC, or other connected asset. Lastly, optimize and collaborate. One of the greatest benefits of a truly connected enterprise is the ability to link and share valuable information across people, devices, and machines. You also must consider what capabilities you will deploy to help drive collaboration, whether it's within a single site, between a site and the enterprise, or across multiple facilities and supply chains. Every manufacturer and industrial operator will enter and progress through the stages of the connected enterprise execution model that is most appropriate for it, at a pace determined by its own needs, infrastructure, readiness, and resources. At Rockwell Automation, we have worked with organizations that are in relatively advanced positions, already leveraging their working data capital and collaborating with suppliers. We also have worked with companies at the beginning of their information technology and operations technology intelligence journeys. There are significant opportunities and profits for both. And like any process, as the goal is continuous improvement, the connected enterprise will constantly evolve over time.